um, I'm really not good at this. Uh, this is literally like the first thing I've ever done. I tried making YouTube videos when I was like in year eight and didn't go very well because everyone found out and I was like the laughing stock. So that was when I was, how old are you in year eight? Like, I don't know, 13? 13? Also, sorry, I'm going to be playing with my hair a lot because I do that a lot when I get nervous. And I don't know why I'm nervous, but I am because this is literally the easiest thing to do. Probably no one's ever going to watch it. Oh, wow. Basically, oh, 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 I have been to my uh, local, what's it called? Shopping, shop, shopping centre. Jesus Christ local shopping centre and I've bought so much stuff it is a bit of a joke and I don't know why <laughs> I've bought so much but I have so that's what I'm going to do today I'm basically going to show you guys what I bought you might be completely disinterested and click off fair enough you can do that or you might be really interested or just be nosy so right so first I went to oh my god my, one of my favourite places in the whole entire world. I don't know why I bought half of this stuff, to be completely honest. But you know when you're in a shop and you're just like, you know that you have money to kind of like, not waste, but like, if you like pick a couple of things, you're like, oh, I think that's quite nice. Oh yeah, I think I, think I could afford that. And then you get way too carried away and end up with this. So this is basically what happened. So from Wilco, oh, the first thing I got is really weird um, because it's literally like, I have an obsession with it right now. And it is so like, it just reminds me of like childhood, like proper like primary school times. And it literally just like, oh, like even looking at it, it makes me like so I really want like a massive glass of it so bear with but I basically got a massive bottle of Robinson's apple and blackcurrant real fruit squash basically blackcurrant squash I love squash everyone's always out there and all these girls are like oh my god you need to drink water Water, 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 water. It's gonna do amazing things for your skin. Water's so good for you. Water's the way to go. I, I don't like water. <laughs> like, I know it sounds really weird. Like, I know, you, like, water doesn't taste of anything. And water, water, it's water. How can you not like water? I just don't like it. Like, I just, I, it's so boring to me and it doesn't make me hydrated. It dries out my mouth. It just makes me feel ill. So, I just don't like water. Really weird. So, the way I get my, water into my system is with squash because it's just I love it. I love squash. So good. Ah. So that's the first thing I got. Second thing I got is I feel like this is really boring. I bought deodorant. I know it is a bit boring but it's deodorant and everyone needs deodorant and you know don't want to be smelling gotta make sure you're not stinking up the place you're not being disgusting so i get the dove because i promise you they are the best like with deodorants i know that like a lot of people think that shaw's really good <sighs> like me and my best friend we always say it just like shaw just doesn't work like it, does, it doesn't like like stay and actually like make you not smell whereas dove always does so you know a lot of fun there I get the Dove Invisible Dry. I don't know what one this. I don't really know how to sweat. Tested on 100 colours, one fourth moisturising cream, 48 hour. This one, basically. And I get this one because obviously it's it doesn't go onto clothes. And I wear a lot of different colours. Like I sometimes like I wear white, sometimes I wear black, and then sometimes I'm wearing blue. Well. I always wear blue. I don't know why. If you can't really tell, I really like blue. 
Um, I wear like all sorts of different colours and it's really annoying when like you get that white stuff coming from your deodorant and you just don't want it. So I use this one because it's and it smells so good. It's the clean touch one. And it is oh honestly really nice. And it says <laughs> I've just read here, it says building girls self-esteem. So I mean it hasn't built much self-esteem for me, it just make sure that I don't smell, but you know, that goes on. Next thing I've got. Can you take a wild guess as to what this is? First thing you should know about me, I really, 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 really like bunnies <laughs> and like rabbits. <laughs> Basically, <laughs> I've got a bunny mug and it's blue and it's got the cutest little bunny on it with a little ear. It literally just says mug bunny on the bottom. Kind of, it's quite a good size. I mean, it's, I mean, I haven't got a big head, but you can kind of, you can, you can, you can, it's a big mug. And then the last thing I got from Wilco, I only got four bits, but you know, uh, the last thing I got was, I, you could say I'm quite early. I got the Febreze Air Mist Spiced Apple. I love Christmas with a burning passion. Christmas is my everything. I freaking love it. I always have like a little mini tree in my room. It's not real, obviously, because I've got carpet and that's a mess. Um, but yeah, I literally just got so excited when I saw this and it was only like, what, a pound 50? How much was it? Two pounds, two pounds that was. So, and it's like the limited edition stuff. So from Wilco, not too bad. Um, and it smells incredible. Hang on, just. Oh, oh what am I? <laughs> oh my God. But that literally smells like my Christmas is oh that's so good my christmas is literally like in my house it's all about like the spices and like it's always like spiced apple or like i my favorite candle is from yankee candle it's the red apple wreath and that's very like appley spicy like that's like the kind of smell that my like house traditionally has so that scent for me is like christmas some people like like the christmas kind of cookie smell or like um uh like the berry smell Personally, I don't really like the cookie smell because it makes me feel a little bit sick, but fair enough. Um, a lot of people like that gingerbread. I do like gingerbread, um, like the scents. I've got a couple of gingerbread candles already, but yeah, amazing stuff. So that's everything I got from Wilco. Where did I go next? Next I went to TK Maxx and TK Maxx is honestly, the home section in TK Maxx is literally my favourite place to go ever. I'm pretty sure though I heard today that some lady saying it was going to close, as in like the one near me is closing. Are you joking? Because it's literally huge. It's not a, it's not a home sense. Like I haven't really got a home sense near me, but it's like we've got a, like a three floor TK Maxx and the whole top floor is at home. So... If it closes, I'm gonna be fuming. I've got really random things from TK Maxx and I feel like everyone says that because you can never really go to TK Maxx and just be like, oh, I got like normal things because you didn't, because you can't. Basically, <laughs> I really like these crisps called hippies, right? And they are organic chickpea puffs. 90 calories per serving i don't know what one serving is supposed to be they are i think they're like some kind of like, i don't know if they're, are they vegan yep they're vegan so it's non-msg dairy free vegan gluten free high in fiber and a source of protein and basically i always get the um sweet and smoking flavor because oh my god i'm so excited to eat these <laughs> like so excited to eat these. I saw these and these are one these were one pound seventy nine. One pound seventy nine for a bag as big as my head. And they like they're they're quite like they feel quite full. So fingers crossed. So I got okay, this is where it gets bad. Because I did not just get one bag. I got three of the same flavour. 
three, not one, not two, three. Not only did I get those, which obviously were enough, and then I got these ones because I've never tried them before and they're just called, they're the same thing, they're just called, but different flavour and they're called In Herbs We Trust. I, oh, apparently, oh, these are 89 calories per serving. So apparently, um, somehow these are one calorie less. And then the last thing I got from TK Maxx, again, makes absolutely no sense, was a, I don't know if you can see that, a laundry basket just for my room that says organise. Yeah, it's not too big. I got the smaller one and that was £7.99. pence. I got that because my room, if you can see the floor right now, is a bit of a joke. Like my clothes, literally, the minute you clean it and I'm like, okay, I put my clothes away, I'm not gonna do it again. It's a fat chance. It's good. I've got a floor dry, basically. But there's not much I can do about that. So well, there is, because I've got this now. So hopefully no more floor joke. So yeah, that's everything I got from TK Maxx. And then next I went into um we've got like this old um I think it's a chain. I don't I don't know if it's in like the company. Um like an old sweet shop called Mr. Sims Sweet Shop on the um high street. Like where the shopping center is and um yeah they sell like american sweets they have like the ones where it's like all of the sweets like pretty much ever made and yeah you can put it in like bags and like get like measurements of it like you know when you ask for like 100 grams of so and so so i got <laughs> i really don't know why i got these i spent 4.99 on these um to be honest, I have been looking for these for a really long time. Um, they are the they're Pop Tarts Frosted S'mores. And they're a big box to be fair, there's eight of them. And they just look absolutely delicious. And uh, yeah, can't go wrong. Can't go wrong, you know? Happy days. Next thing I got were um, Apple candy cables because I love Apple. Anything Apple, and I like candy cables. Um, if you don't know what candy cables are, they're kind of, I think in America people they call them licorice. I don't know. It's not like licorice flavoured, it's not like aniseed licorice stuff. Last but not least, I went into one of my favourite places in the whole wide world. I went into Lush. Basically, long story short, they've got all their Christmas stuff. Also, sorry if you can hear like banging around, screaming, shouting. We've got builders in and my sister's just shouting. So Lush have all their Christmas stuff in and that means dangerous game for Laura. So the first thing I got was the candy cane reusable bubble bar. I kid you not, this gets me so excited. I'm so excited, oh my God, it's really sad. It says, bubble bars, crumble as much of a bar as you like under warm running water, create a mountain of luxurious film style bubbles. Reusable bubble bars, Simpl simply whisk into, your, whisk into your bath water and hold it or hold under a cold tap to whip up a blissful bar. And this one, I'm not trying not to rip it. It looks like this. So, oh my God, so cute. I love it. It's making my hands like all funny already, but you know, it's not actually got glitter on it, which I love because I, I, I love glitter. <laughs> but Lush is like a lot of glitter sometimes, and especially at Christmas. Yeah, this one, if you know Lush already, it smells like Snow Fairy. If you don't know what that is, 
basically Snow Fairy has been around for ages. Oh my god. Mm. And it's more like a... I got it because it's more... I like Snow Fairy, but it's more of a dull down kind of version. And it's not as strong, which I love because... Oh, I can't. Oh, it's so good. Basically, it's quite a sweet one. So you can, like... You can see how it would, like, give you a headache. So, yeah. That's the first thing I got. Um, I can't remember how much that was actually. Uh, let's have a look. Candy cane reusable bar. That was three ninety five. That one. The next one. Shoot for the stars bath bomb. Oh my god! Literally. Look at it. Literally. Look at it. Look how nice it looks. This one's more like fresh. Like definitely more fresh less intense and definitely like a evening i think because it's got like i think it's got some kind of maybe lavender oh God, i'm really like blue now so that's great i don't know where i'm gonna i'm awful <laughs> i literally just wiped that straight into my carpet oops oh, oh i love this one this one's been around for a really long time this is the luxury lush hood bath bomb oh, i love this one so much it's been around for ages i think I literally i got this first time i got this was when i was like 13 maybe so very long time ago oh, look at it love this one oh, that one smells like um a bit like oh what's it called the, is it the refresher no the comforter the comforter that one's really good and it's got little holly at the top and i'm ugly excited about that so so yeah flush pud next one was oh i like this one lord of misrule i think that's more like a i always thought it was a, like a we three kings kind of thing like a reference to that lord i don't know it only comes out christmas so i don't know how that relates to Christmas, but I'm guessing the Wee Three Kings. This one's a lot more plain looking. It looks like this, but it's got like a crown kind of going around it. Sorry, it's my like janky nails. Um, and this one, this one smells like quite herby and like quite like really like natural, like kind of grassy, kind of like not dirty, but like <laughs> oh yeah. That one's really good. I really like that one. And then the last thing, I think for this entire video as well, I think, don't quote me on that, is the last one I got was the, oh, this one. Okay, so my favorite one, my favorite bath bomb, anything around Christmas time is um, So White. And that is from, it's just a plain white bath bomb from Lush inside, it's pink and it smells like apples, like fresh, apples like crispy apples so that is um usually my favorite one but they didn't have it so you know depressing um so the last one i got is golden wonder again it says the same thing on the writing so there's no point in me even reading that out and this one is my second favorite because it smells incredible and it is like christmas like honestly Oh my god. It's got something in it. Look in here. What the hell's inside? I didn't know that. Anyway. Are you serious? Oh. oh. It kind of smells like... It's really fresh. <laughs> I feel like I've said that so many times. But it's really fresh. It's really like very fruity and it kind of smells like cow pot <laughs> if you're from the uk i think it's just in the uk but i could be wrong um if you're from the uk cow pot, like the the medicine the orange one it kind of smells like that but not really oh it smells incredible and it's massive like huge for a bath bomb you can kind of see already there's blue on the inside so it's like a nice surprise it's like completely like turquoisey blue and it makes your bath really like blue and nice 
so and obviously my favorite color is blue so big surprise there as to why it's my favorite Lush stuff amazing if you did enjoy it please do give it a like if you didn't fair enough that's your own opinion i kind of get it subscribe if you really want i'm pretty sure i'm going to keep doing some more of these kind of videos like hauls or makeup stuff kind of fashiony stuff random stuff <laughs> but yeah thank you very much for watching today and i hope you have a good day whatever you're doing or a good evening um and i will see you very very soon bye